East meets West, equally important, East should meet East. Professor Li Chinchuan, head of COM, spoke on June 19th on the first joint PhD students' research symposium between City U and Tokyo University. He hoped the symposium would mark the beginning of a long friendship between the two institutions. This is the first joint PhD research between the two universities. Professor Kayori Hayashi from Tokyo University Graduate School of Interdisciplinary Information Studies praised the significance of this symposium when she noted. So you meet people now, and I'm sure in 10 years or in 20 years, you meet them again, and maybe perhaps you talk about the uh, uh, research collaborations. Professor Lee quoted Confucius' word in his opening remark to thank her for being instrumental in making this symposium and further research collaboration possible. <laughs> Confucius said, what a joy to have friends from coming from afar. And he also said, learning without companionship is bound to be narrow and parochial. I mean, we have you as friends. And I hope this is the beginning of a long-standing friendship. The theme of the symposium is from the emerging issues of conventional media to the recurring issues of emerging media. Presenters included eight City U students and nine Tokyo U students. They addressed a wide range of topics and issues on media industries, content, and audiences, with evidence from Japan, Hong Kong, China, Korea, and Brazil. In the concluding session, each participant tweeted, all expressing appreciation for the opportunity to expand their horizon by learning what each other was doing. I'm actually always very interested when we have these symposiums as to the theoretical um, differences in the research between the students from the different universities and the approaches that we take. We know such countries like US or UK much better than we know those uh, neighboring countries, but ex exchanging ideas within uh, Asia, the, the, the big community, I think in that sense it's a really valuable experience. It was felt, furthermore, that Asian scholars would benefit from more interaction and from periodic reflection on the development of media studies that pursues theoretical generality without losing cultural specificity. They also visited the department's new lab in the Inner Center and were impressed by the state-of-the-art equipment. CTV reports.